July 2014 EMPC <coughs> Planning and Preparedness Award application. Mr. Ty. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, this is some of the funding that each year GEMA uh, makes available to local local counties for uh, to address improvements in planning and preparedness to, to upgrade our capabilities. Uh, what we're requesting this time is um, kind of to supplement an earlier grant that, that been, had been proposed for some AEDs, and this is for some equipment to conduct CPR training. Uh, this this uh, equipment, if it, if this application is approved, would be used primarily for to help keep our public safety, our firefighters, law enforcement, EMS, those type. It would be made available to them um, for that continuing CPR training that they need as first responders. Then also um, for for the general public, for local volunteer groups to help us out during disasters. All, all, basically anybody that needed CPR, we, we would make this available, which would increase our capabilities if we were to have an event or, or you know, something go on in one of these buildings. And again, like I said, that would supplement the AEDs that we will hopefully be getting um, from, a, from a separate grant. So be glad to answer any questions you have about that. Any questions for Mr. Ty? So this is primarily AED training, not resusciani? Well, no, it, it's, it's both. It'll be CPR and then the AED is a component of that CPR training. So, um, you know, it will be the, you know, the compressions and breathing, that kind of stuff. Um, and then the AED training is primarily would be for people in the buildings that have an AED or, you know, like law enforcement, firefighters, they carry those on their, on their vehicles. So we want them to have that training. So if they arrive on scene, you know, the first ones to get there, they can, they kind of know what to do and can, can assist. And I would point out too that like most of the GEMA grants, this is a 50-50. So we're requesting the $2,500 of cash from GEMA to pay for the equipment, and then we'll meet our match, um, like the time that we spend conducting the training, holding the classes, that would satisfy our match requirement. So on the county's part, we won't have to, to um, come up with any cash to, to meet that. Can that training also be scheduled for the downtown buildings here? We can schedule it for anybody and everybody that's, that wants the training. Yeah, I think it's important that, you know, the downtown buildings make sure they get involved in that training too. And, and we could do that now. This just helps, basically helps us get more people through right. by, add, by adding more equipment. So. Any other questions? All right, hearing none, we'll move on to 